Hello, YouTubers. This is Safe Man and Joe once again with Jag Sports Cards. Hey, went down to my local card shop today, and that would be Matt Massetti over at Baseball Cards over in Fresno, California. So, hey, if you're ever in the area, go by, check out the shop. All right, hey, got the 2022 Phoenix made by Panini. Now, if you've been watching my videos, you know Phoenix is my favorite. Um, I prefer Phoenix over Prism. I prefer Phoenix over Optic. Uh, and usually ends up being a little bit cheaper of a product, but just as many, um, just as many bangers in these in, as in a prism, my opinion, and just as good looking. I think so. I think even better looking than a prism sometimes. So, um, hey, we're going to open these up and, uh, there used to be, you know, um, some sealed, uh, a sealed card in it like that, that you would, and it would be in a one touch with a sticker on it and everything like that. But those days are gone. But, and this is the hobby product, which I do not believe there's a retail of this. So this is a hobby only, which makes it even more preferable for me as well. See, See being hobby only. Okay. In this product, you're going to get 12 packs per box and there's going to be five cards per back, per pack. Okay. You're going to also find two autographs, and one memorabilia card per average. Okay, which, hey, man, if you've been watching the videos, you know, hey, man, sometimes we beat that average a little bit. Or kind of got two autos instead of an auto and a memorabilia. So, hey, I don't know. I think we won on that one. Um, so what we're also doing is we're unwrapping nine numbered parallels in this box. And we're also looking for the ultra rare inserts, the archetype, and the Metropolis. Okay, haven't seen those right there. Go ahead if you want. You can go ahead and pause right there and see exactly what's available in the product there. But yeah, man, let's get to ripping on this. Yeah, like I said, this is one of my this is my favorite product. Um, I'm glad that it has stayed relatively inexpensive, I guess. This is gonna run you about 340. So that's honestly, that's a good price for for today's market. Would that, would that make sense? Uh, for today's market, that is actually not bad. So we're going to go ahead and take that out right there. And that is our box and packs right there. So, but you notice it had Garrett Wilson as the cover boy for the product. But on the packs... It's Zach Wilson. <laughs> so here we go. All right, here. That's a little different right there on the uh, the Phoenix. So, hey, if you have the opportunity to buy some Phoenix, if you can get in a break or what have you, um, hey, save up and get a box. You know, they're going to run you about $340. I know on the website it has $299, but by the time you get done with taxes and everything like that and shipping, it's going to run you about $340. So here we go. If you haven't seen that design, that's the basic design right there. All right. Hey, like I said, I think somewhere, I guess, design wise between like a mosaic and a prism or optic. But I, I, like I said, I prefer this. I, I prefer the Phoenix. All right. Hey, we got our first hit right here in this one. All right. We got an, a rookie card of Bull Melton of the Sea Hags and we got an Aiden Hutchinson. And this one's 97 of 99. Let's see what we got. Oh, nice. All right. Hey, man, I'll live with that. This kid is good, too, man. I Now, given that Jared Goff was traded to um, Detroit, I've been watching a lot of Detroit games, and this kid can play, man. So I'm kind of glad to get him. He's kind of a high-motor guy, another T.J. Watt kind of guy, um, another... I, you know, that outside edge rusher type of guy. Nice. And this one's 97 out of 99. And it's what? Three stripes, basically. Or two stripes. Uh-huh. All right. And we finish up with a prism or a silver hollow of a Dawson Nix. Uh-huh. There we go. Put that off on the side. Hey, all right. So first pack, first hit. So we hit our memorabilia card, which was nice, which is a nice one. Of a very good rookie, man. You know what? That was nice. I can't complain about that hit. I can't. You know? There we go. So, Rogers. All right, here we go. Tyquan Thornton, rookie card. And got an Eli Mitchell. And I was going to say, I this is a ruby or a red parallel. 
And this one is 130 of 150. There we go. Or, I don't know, what, a teal? Maybe? Teal? So I'm not... Like I said, for it being my one of my my or my favorite product that comes out, I, I'm not very attuned of what's what's available for it. So I usually buy a box or two a year. I'm not like I said, I'm a collector. I'm not gonna I'm not this guy is gonna buy multiple boxes. What you see is what I open, and that's basically what I what, what I buy. So there we go. We got a hot routes, Mike Williams. Kind of interesting to see that where he how he's gonna end up working with Justin Herbert because. Rumor has it Keenan Allen probably might be released. So Mike, that puts Mike Williams in the forefront. So let's see. All right, here we go. Chad Muma, linebacker, rookie card. And here we go. We have a Rashad White right there from the Buccaneers. That's cool, man. What is that, Molten or something like that? Yeah. Okay, this is... 55 out of 175. There we go. Nice little background. That's a that's a nice card. That's a real see. Like I said, man, I think I think Phoenix is by far the best product that comes out year by year. That's like I said, that's my opinion. And I know a lot of the factory sets kind of sit around and don't get sold or what have you. But tell me, that's a nice looking card right there. And like I said, for 340, you can't beat it. Can't beat the price. There we go. And we got a flamethrowers of Joe Burrow. Uh-huh. All right. Next pack. So we're still due two autographs. So, uh-huh. Let's see. Let's see who ended up. Mariota, who was just released. It's going to... I have... I don't know if he's a bust or just things just didn't work out for him. Here we go. Calvin Austin the third Rookie card. And... Speaking of, the guy who took his place, Ryan Tannehill. And this is a flamethrower. I don't believe this is... Yeah, this one's numbered. This one's numbered 47 of 50. Uh-huh. That's not bad. That's a nice one. That's a cool looking card. Like I said, they're nice looking cards. I, by far, think these are the best, man. Um, as far as design, I don't know who designs Phoenix within Panini or what have you, but hey, man... You got mine. There we go. And we finish up with a Hot Routes Tyreek Hill. I said, look at that card. That's a nice, that's a nice, nice card. All right, here we go. Next pack. I don't know, we're, I guess about a third way through the box. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Yeah, yeah we got five boxes, five packs. Okay, all right, here we go. Shot Penny. And we got a Michael Carter. Trey McBride. And our next one, ah, uh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and do this one. Oh, there we go. Allen Robinson. There we go. And I don't think that, that was a silver hollow. And we we'll finish up behind the trade McBride is, oh, a Romeo Dobbs. Oh, nice. Tell me that's not a nice card. Wow. Oh, really nice card. And this one, and this one's numbered 33 of 149. That's a 149 card. Right there with Romeo Dobbs and the what the multicolored patch. That's a multicolored patch RPA. Nice. Oh, so hey, this is a an NFC North heavy box, huh? Shoot. All right. Hey man, I I dig it. That is a look at that card. That's nice, man. You know what? I, I hope that Phoenix doesn't end up taking off. You know what I mean? Like all of a sudden everybody wants to start buying Phoenix and it gets popular and now I can't buy them for a decent price. Like, you know, like Prism and everything else. So, you know, hopefully, again, for those of you out there, Phoenix is bad. Very, very bad. Don't buy Phoenix. <laughs> all right. Derek Stingley, Derek Stingley Jr. There we go. And we got a Chad Muna again. And this is a, okay, this one is a pink, I believe. Oh, here we go. These are kind of cool. The contours. Kind of dig these. Um, the Alvin Kamara. Those are kind of cool. All right. And we got a pink Chad Muma. And this one is numbered 161 of 199. Uh -huh. I'm still kind of with that. I'm still kind of crushing on that Dobbs, man. Actually, you know what? The Aiden Hutchinson too. For it being a multicolored patch, that's sweet, man. That is really sweet. Uh-huh. All right. Here we go. 
Uh huh. And to be honest with you, we're getting a pretty good little stack of cards for our 340. We got a nice little stack, and they're really pretty cards. You know what I mean? I think they're really nice. Justin Ross. Uh huh. And we have a Justin Ross again, man. Here we go. And this one is a red. And this one is 238 out of 250. Now, I I don't know about collation. That might be a, a thing with Panini now going. Um, I don't know. Is it, is it okay to have that, the numbered rookie right behind the base rookie in a deal? I mean, is that okay? Or would you like to kind of have it spread out a little bit more? Carson Wentz, who was just released by Washington, the Washington football team. Uh -huh. Here we go. Again, we've got one autograph due to us now. Uh huh. On average, take it from the box. Trevor Lawrence. Yeah, we got a, a Tyler Batty. And I think we got it right here. All right, here we just go in the back. Andrew Booth Jr., rookie card. And. We're going to go ahead and just kind of turn it there. Okay, we've got a Derek Stingley Jr. Rookie card. Auto. And this one is numbered 30 of 99. Well, that Texan fan right there would appreciate that. That's a, you know, that's a pretty cool little card. Like I said, um, you're going to get the same thing that you're going to get out of Prism, out of Optic. Actually, I think you get a better deal, <coughs> to be honest with you. Um, you end up getting two autographs, and a memorabilia card in Phoenix, as opposed to Prism that you end up getting, what, two autos? And I don't know what, a lot of patch cards in the retail. And there's no retail of this, which makes it even less plentiful. Does that make sense? Kind of a deal. I mean, there's there's less of this running around than there is Prism, because of just because of the retail. Mike Williams. There we go. Cover board, Garrett Wilson. And we got the blank. <laughs> All right, here we go. We've got Roger Stallback. And that's a fire, fire forged. Those are cool looking cards too. Those are cool. Okay, and this one is 179 of 199. See, that's cool. Um, see a cowboy fan really digging on that one? I could see a cowboy fan really, really liking that one, right? Hey, it's a pretty card. Look at that. Like I said. Phoenix, again, one of those, Phoenix is, is going to, the product I think that's going to go under the radar a lot, that I, I hope it does, flamethrowers right there with T-Law, uh-huh, now, hey, we got three packs left, now we are, we're kind of hit with everybody there, we've got our two autos, so now what we're looking for, we're looking for the, for some more numbered parallels, let's see if we can get a one one somewhere, that'd be kind of cool, let's get one of those, man, that would be nice to get one of the the case hits. That'd be nice. There we go. Kawhi Walker. And, oh, nice. And this is a Contours and Jamar Chase. Nice. What is this? Green, I think. And this is 150 of 150. Nice. All right. And Jamar Chase, man. You know, that that's that's a pretty good one. Jamar Chase is a very heady player, man. Um, him and Joe, Joe Burrow, little stuff here and there and everything like that, like I said, but clean that up. Yeah, nice, 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 nice. And we finish up with a Jalen Waddle. Didn't we get a Tyreek Hill of the Hawk Routes as well right there? So uh, I, I have my dogs in my garage with me. It's really cold here in California. If it, man, it, it, we are not used to this cold in California. It's like really cold. Um, we're kind of really spoiled by really good weather and everything like that. But yeah, man, it's been really cold. We got a lot of snow in our mountains, things like that. So we're doing pretty good, man. Danny Gray, rookie card. Oh, all right. Hey, we got a cracked ice. Bo Melton for the Seahawks. Nice. See, get the cracked ice right there. Tell me that that is a nice card. Look at that card. That is a pretty card. And this one is numbered six of 50. Nice. That cracked ice is nice. That's a pretty card, man. Like I said, I might go buy another couple boxes. Heck, man. Um, I like them just because I like the cards. 
not looking investment wise or what have you. I mean, I know a lot of people overlook Phoenix, but that's a nice card, man. <laughs> nice. All right. Hey, there we go. Finish up with a rookie rising Christian Watson who started to kind of gel with Rajas towards the end right there, which hey, it could be a good sign for any Packer fans if he stays. All right. Hey, last pack of Phoenix. Like I said, I think I've had a pretty good box. I like it. it. To me, it's been fun. It's a fun rip. So, all right, man, last pack. Here we go. Galladay. Lock it. Nick, Nick Bonito. Bonito. All right. And we got a Cleo Mack. And I, you know what? I forgot that Cleo Mack was with uh, the Chargers now. That's a silver hollow right there. Put that on the side. And we finish up with, we started with an Aiden Hutchinson. And we finish up with an Aiden Hutchinson for the Detroit Lions. That's a rookie card of Contours. I think those are cool looking cards. Those are really cool looking cards. Really cool. All right, hey, here we go. Again, let's go ahead and stack them up here. For your for your buck, as far as hobby-wise, for a hobby-only product. Nice. Nice. You got a nice little healthy stack right there. Plus, hey, there's our autograph. I think these are th those are awesome. Right there. Let's just go ahead and just kind of put those there for a second or two. I think those are awesome. Hey, all right, man. Hey, thank you for the view. I'm Sable Man and Joe. Um, if you're watching, hey, man, you're one of the few. You're one of the cool. You are very, very, very much appreciated. So, um, hey, don't forget to get in on the giveaway contest. What the rule, or I'll go ahead and let you know there. Um, Tomorrow is the last day. Today is uh, the last day of February. Tomorrow is March 1st. So tomorrow will be the deadline for the giveaway. So watch the 2022 uh, Illusions um, Blaster Box video and comment on that video and you will be entered for the giveaway. All right. So, hey, just go ahead and just show those cards off again. I thought those were pretty cool. All right. Hey, and... In case you forgot, this is what our giveaway is. Hey, we're giving away that. Soccer pack. We're giving away a hockey pack. We're giving away a football pack. We're giving away a tops pack. We're giving away a basketball blaster. And to go along with that, what are cards without having the penny sleeves? Or, for that matter, for not having the top loader. We're giving you all those right there for the giveaway. So, like I said, watch the 2022 Illusions Blaster Box video and comment on it. Hey, if you want, you can subscribe. I'd appreciate it very much. And we will be doing a subscriber uh, giveaway pretty soon as well. So, hey, again... Watch the video, comment, you will be entered, and March 1st, tomorrow, I will pick a winner at random. Probably 9 p.m. Pacific, I think I put the time, all right? Hey, thank you very much for the view. Save Man and Joe Harris says, hey, take it easy, and everybody be safe out there, all right? Hey, take it, bye, and see you next time.